Good morning, my loves. I just received an image just before coming in here. And the image was of a spiral, which kind of looked like a vortex to me. So with a spiral, we can choose to experience it. We can choose to view it in many different ways. A spiral can be viewed as something that can move up. A spiral is something that can be viewed as going down. A spiral can be viewed as something that is around and around in circles. So I feel like there is a message for someone. I feel like I'm being in this in the middle of it. So I feel like there's a message for someone that Maybe perhaps you're feeling like you're going around and around in circles and maybe you've been feeling like this for the last couple of months, which is really interesting because I just had a conversation um, with one of my girlfriends about things coming to the surface and I was being shown an image of water, but when you have, you know, residue and you've got that shit that kind of sits at the bottom of like a fish tank, right? You, you've got that that kind of settles and it sits at the bottom of the fish tank. And unless you stir up that stuff that sits, that crud that sits at the bottom of the fish tank, it kind of looks like the water's crystal clear, right? But I feel like over the last couple of months, there's been a shake up for the collective, okay? So if you feel like there has been a shake up and there has been all of this muck that has just kind of come to the surface and you're still trying to piece through it and it feels like you're going around and around and around in circles. I want you to see how you're perceiving your own spiral, how you're perceiving your own vortex because you can perceive it depending on what eyes you choose to look through. You can choose to look through the eyes of it spiraling downwards or you can look at this as if, yes, okay, it feels like you're going around and around and around, but if you were to really open your eyes and actually see that this round and round and round motion has actually led you up to further growth, I want you to be able to recognize actually how far you've come. Because it's, again, it depends on which eyes you choose to see life out of. And we get to choose at any given state how we choose to perceive our own reality. And if we don't like what we see, we get to change it by simply changing how we view it. So if you have been experiencing this ruffledness of stuff that's been laying dormant and this may be things that you feel like you've been you've already healed or you've already you know come to terms with but for some reason over the last couple of months which again it's got to do with the planets and and what we're shifting into into the new age of Aquarius it's that stuff that's been laying dormant that's now coming to the surface. This is a time to recognize actually how far you've come. Because sometimes when we're in this spiral, when we're in this vortex stage, it's very easy for us to feel like we're being sucked down. But again, that's a perception. Instead of recognizing actually how far you have expanded. And we're now sitting in the energy of Jupiter in Gemini as well, which Jupiter is Sagittarius, which is all about expansion. Gemini is all around truth. So where is it that if you're sitting in a state where you feel like you're going around and around in circles, where can you expand in your own truth? And where can you do this with integrity? Not to anybody else, but to yourself. Because that's where the real shift's going to start to happen. You can play with this energy. You can expand in your own spiral, in your own vortex. Where can you start to bring more truth? 
to your reality? Where can you start seeing through the eyes of authenticity instead of looking behind a mask? Because I don't feel like you're doing yourself I don't feel like you're, you're, um, I don't feel like you're, 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 you're witnessing actually how far you've grown and how far you've come. So if this is something that you've been feeling, I want you to know that what is being cleared out, one, it is ready. Two, it doesn't serve you. Three, you have the strength to do it. Four, you're not stuck and you're not going around in circles because if you if you really look, you will see actually how far you have grown and it's been an upwards circle, not a downward spiral. 